Hello my magical friends. I am here today because I didn't film a Christmas video around Christmas and I really wanted to but just I didn't have the time to so I figured that I should just show you guys some of the stuff that I got for Christmas. These are all various things from my family members and Sebastian who is basically like my family. Yeah and I also just wanted to put it out there that I really hope that this doesn't look like I'm like oh here are all the cool stuff I got. To be honest I've been pretty sad this last like two days so I just wanted to get my mind off of that and just film something fun and lighthearted. So here we are. <laughs> By the way, if you are new to my channel, my name is Mary Bell. Don't forget to swish and flick the subscribe button down below to be a part of my Slither Bell army here on YouTube. This is a print that I got from my twin sister. It's definitely my art style. It's kind of cartoony and it's really simple and because I like that minimalistic kind of look. I don't have much on my walls, so this is bound to brighten up my space a bit. It's a print of Copenhagen. I'm trying to straighten it out because it's been rolled up. And it's got that cute kind of Danish architecture, which I love. I'm not sure what the name of the Etsy page is, but I'll look it up after I film this and I'll just put this Etsy page on here somewhere. For those of you who want to get something similar or the same one, there are a few other designs that you can check out. I got this furry throw blanket from my mom. I love throws, especially in like a cream or white color. I have another one on my couch. So this I'm probably gonna put on my bed or something. Then I got from my mom again, these two PJs and you can't really see them from this shot, but I'll put in a B-roll shot. This is what it looks like tried on. My older sister got me this artwork. It's like textured art from Etsy as well. But this is artwork that says Wingardium Leviosa. And then it also has the swish and flick wand movements. My twin sister got something similar but with a different spell. So the artist is Jen Garmin. So for my older sister, I got some Sephora gift cards. If you guys know Miniso, it's this really cute Japanese store that sells these really affordable but really great products. And um, this has like, this has a bunch of hair brushes and combs and stuff. It has like this rat tail comb, which is definitely something I need. I don't actually have because I braid my hair a lot. Can't forget these chocolate treats. I honestly am not even sure if this is Sebastian's um, gifts that he got because it wasn't, we put our presents together in a, the same box. So I'm not sure if he got this, but he's not here right now. So I'm probably gonna eat a lot of his chocolate. Yeah, of course, my mom being my mom, whenever she comes to my place, she's always complaining about the fact that I don't have towels, hand towels, face towels, whatever towels, even though I do have them, I just don't have a lot because I don't like having a lot of stuff. Um, but yeah, so she got me face towel and then another face towel from Miniso. She also got me a kitchen hand towel and then also, <coughs> I'm fine, I'm good. Cool. She also got me these slippers, which are super soft. And then my mom also got me this bath mat. What, what are these called again? A bath rug, but I'm thinking of putting it someplace other than the bathroom. I don't know. I'll figure it out. It's from DKNY. She got me these like hair clips for when I'm doing, when I'm washing my face, when I'm doing my makeup. Honestly, I'm so glad she got these for me because every time I see girls doing like a tutorial or washing their face and they have one of these, I'm like, that's such a good idea. I should probably get one, but I had no idea where to get it. I think these are from Miniso. I don't know. I, I already used two of them. I threw out the packaging, so I'm pretty sure it's from Miniso though. My mom also got me this hair remover roller. So it's like a lint roller and it just like flip, flips up and then you just kind of roll your clothes with it. I should say my mom picks out the presents, but my dad is also involved in like gifting and stuff like that. Sorry, daddy, I don't mean to not involve you in this video. My wonderful Swede, he knows that I 
am a tea drinker. I drink a lot of tea. I drink coffee as well, but not as much as I drink tea. And we went to this specific cafe in Sweden. It's like their version of Starbucks, but better. He got me this box of coffee, tea, goodies. He got me this chai tea. I love the packaging, it's adorable. All of these products that he got me are from Espresso House. These are two different types of travel mugs. This is just like um, reusable like coffee cup, which is very smart. It comes with its own sleeve, a rubber sleeve. Uh, Eco-friendly, folks. This honestly is probably my favorite out of the two because it's like a coffee travel mug thermos and you just you open it up pour in your coffee close it you know we all know how to do this and there's a button up here you press it and there's like a little hole and it opens up for you to be able to drink it but it's like almost like there's a slight little cover over it so the heat doesn't come out this has stayed hot even with the button pressed down this has stayed hot for two hours for me. When you press it all the way, it like, I don't even know. I've never tried it, but it probably stays hot for like, for your entire life. And he also got me my favorite chocolates from Sweden. For those of you who have never tried these, I wish I could share it with you right now. They're so simple, but they're so good. I've been eating so much crap this holiday. I need to stop, I need to work out. This. I mean, technically would be in my monthly favorites, but I'm not doing that this month. <laughs> so I decided to include it here, but this was basically like a Christmas present that I got for myself, which is kind of lame, but you know, we all do it. So um, I got myself a book. It's one of the three books by Mike Viking. Is it Viking or Viking? Viking? I guess that's how you say it, Viking. I have his first book, the little book of Hygge. But this one is, I believe, the second one, which is the little book of, oh, I need to figure out how to pronounce this, but is it like Luca? Luca? Maybe the Danes out there that are watching me can tell me how to pronounce this. So this is the Danish search for the world's happiest people. And I love these books. They just, ugh, they make me feel so warm and fuzzy and just, they really ground me. There's just a specific feeling when I read his books. The photography, the art, that's a bookmark. Yeah, everything about his books are fantastic. There's just that vibe of coziness in his books. The next thing I have here is a box. It says beard bangs. Beard bangs. Oh, I didn't see this. See, I love this kind of artwork. It's so cute. Yeah, beardbangs.ca. Oh, Canadian. It says here, all the paper can be recycled. The packing peanuts are biodegradable, made of cornstarch, and can be composted or dissolved in water. Oh, oh love this art. Okay, sorry. Oh, how come I didn't see this before? A gift for you. Enjoy. From Isabel. So that's my sister. So this is a gift from Etsy. It's very reminiscent to Marzia's ceramics, but it's not Marzia's stuff. This is a three-legged planter shaped like an elephant with the cutest face ever. <laughs> So I can put a cute little plant in it, freaking adorable. Just a quick little note before I sign off here, I asked this amazing artist on Instagram to do a commission for me for my profile picture, just something cute and that felt me, um, that also had a little element of like magic in it, but then also had some like cozy type of, I don't know, something that felt me. So I sent her one of my profile pictures and she kind of sketched from that. Here's what it looks like. I'm so happy with it. I think it's so cute. So for those of you who are wanting to have your own pieces of art, her Instagram handle is choose me or choose my. I will put her Instagram handle, Instagram links or whatever it is 
in my description box. That's it for my video for today. Thank you guys so much for your patience and waiting for videos and thank you for watching this one. I really appreciate the ones who continuously watch me. If you want to follow my social media accounts, all the links are down below. I hope 2020 brings you all lots of happiness. Thank you so much for watching my video. Much love to you all. Thank <laughs> you.